بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم نحمده ونصلي على رسوله الكريم رب اشرح لي صدري ويسر لي امري واحلل عقده من لساني يفقهوا قولي اللهم انفعنا ما علمتنا وعلمنا ما ينفعنا وزدنا علما رب يسر ولا تعسر وتمم الخير so inshallah we will start the first lesson inshallah in this book okay so uh, what we're going to do is this book the whole lesson is based upon this 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 book here uh, but we're going to go through the book but what I want to, what we're going to do is in the book they have these rules and notes we'll do we we'll just number them in here so lesson number one have rule number one and in the new editions we put the word rule so it's easy to navigate okay so it's not in your books so rule numbers but we'll add them in so it's easy to go ahead and we'll go through one by one we'll go through a few exercises inshallah and then um, the rest of you on your own inshallah so to make a, a sentence in Urdu it's very simple you just put here the subject and you guys know Arabic, Arabic so it's called a mubtada the subject and you put the khabar or the predicate yeah, so you have the first thing, you put the subject, thing you're talking about. Then you put the information, which is the khabar. It's called the khabar in Arabic. And then after that, what do you do? You add the joining word, he. So he is the equivalent to the word is. Remember, I'm not from the subcontinent. My parents are from the subcontinent. So my pronunciation is not that good. So don't refer to me on pronunciation. I'll try my best, but pronunciation is not going to be that good. So for example, here we have, so obviously, all is written from left to right. Correct? So you have the, so example, I'm talking about the boy. So the boy is larka. So you put larka. We have larka and you have bimar he. So bimar is a predicate, the thing we're talking about. And then you have the word he is a joining word. So you have the subject comes first, the thing you're talking about comes second, and the third thing is a joining word. So larka, bimar he. Simple sentence. Yeah? So for example, now one other rule is uh, the word e. Sometimes you have to add the word e. In, uh, in Urdu, you don't usually have the particles. You know, you have the word, uh, you have the word e, you have the word the. These things are not found. These things are not found in Urdu language. You don't have the word either. You understand from the context. It seems really strange to us. But when you get used to Urdu, it's like, okay, that's how they speak. Yeah. So for example here. So if you look at it here, Yunus and the word Barhai. Barhai means carpenter. So there's no word, we add the word A. But in here, there's just the subject. There's a predicate and the joining word. There's nothing to show the word A or the, but it's when you translate, you have to add it in. So Yunus is A carpenter. Ahmad Tajir, Ahmad is A businessman. The same comes with the as well. Okay, so example, let's try this one here now. So Zubair, Zubair, Mazdoor hai, Mazdoor is a worker. So how do you translate that? Zubair Mazdoor hai, Zubair is a worker. Adam Mi'mar hai, what's Mi'mar mean? A builder? So how do you translate that? Adam is a builder. Very simple. Arshad, Mochi, Mochi is a cobbler. What's a cobbler? The shoe one. Yeah, the shoe one. The shoe one is called a cobbler. The person who fixes or who mends shoes. And then Fatima, nurse, eh? nurse, it's an English word. So Fatima is a nurse. And Muhammad Wakil, Wakil is a lawyer. So Wakil in Arabic is proxy. Uh, in Urdu, you also use it for proxy as well. Depends on, you can also use it for a, a, um, a lawyer as well. Got it? Okay. Let's do the opposite way around now. English to Urdu, this is a bit harder. Bacha, what's Bacha? I hope I can remember this vocabulary because a long time ago I wrote all of this. So Ahmad is a Bacha, what's Bacha mean? Qasai. So how do you translate? How do you do it in Urdu? Ahmad Qasai. Allah is one. Allah Ahad. Ahad, that's Arabic. Ek. So Allah Ek. Okay. Bacha is Qasai. Next one is Billa. Billa is Mi'mar. So Sufyan is a Billa. Sufyan Mi'mar. Usman is a judge. Usman Qadi. Zahid is a soldier. Sipahi. Sipahi. What's the word? Sipahi. All these vocabularies in the book, we can't go through all the vocabulary exercises. We're going to go through a few. We'll do the exercises off camera, inshallah. Okay? Yes? Okay. Rule number three. So you've got the fir first rule is the, the, the structure. The second rule is you have to add the word A and the accordingly. The third rule is, well, it's a br off branch of the A. There's no word for the in Urdu. As I said before, there's no word for the. Sometimes you have to add it in. So for example here, we have Barhai Amana Darhi. So again, you have the subject, you have the predicate, you have the joining word, but the word is no word for the. In Arabic, you have the alif lam. For those who know Arabic, you have the alif lam, but there's no, you just, barhai aman ad that there's no word for the, you just add it in. So you get it? Tajir kamzor hai, how do translate it? The. There's no word for the, there's no word for a, the particles are not really added in, you have to add them in translation. Yeah, so, darzi, darzi is a, the cloth guy, the cloth one, what's it called in English? Taylor. Taylor. So, darzi chuste. Stingy. 
Cindy, there was one, no. one time Maria so we had a, there was a, there was a teacher's cushion. Okay. So it was getting ripped. So we said, we need to get this fixed. So after a couple of weeks, uh, somebody said, got it, he came back, got it fixed. He goes, Master, how do you get it fixed? He goes, oh, his dad done it. So he goes, how, how do you know his dad is a tailor? How do you know his dad does that? Because his name is Taylor. <laughs> his last name was Yasir Taylor. So the guy said, your dad a tailor? He said, yeah. <laughs> so you got it. <laughs> <laughs> he's never a tailor, so he, actually he was a tailor. So Darzi is a tailor. So Darzi, Chustahi. So Chust means active, Mujtahid, hardworking. So how do you translate this? The. the. So the, uh, the cloth guy, the tailor is active. Next one, Mi'mar, Sustahi. The builder, the other the. So the builder is lazy. And Mochi, Sakhi, Sakhi, or Sakha in Arabic, Sakha, generous. So Mochi, Sakhi, the. Not cobbler. Mochi is cobbler. Mochi is a cobbler. Dobi was donami. Washer. So Dobi is uh, a washerman. People do the laundry. Now it is doing a washing machine. In those times, somebody who actually get a job, give them all the clothes. Even I don't know about now, but when you go for Umrah, you know, or probably quite now still as well. You have even laundromats here as well. But you normally do more complex things. So laundromat people. So Dobi can juice here and nurse tandurus here. The nurses. Healthy. So the whole point all this is, you add the word the. In the translation, you have to add the word the. Got it? Okay. Let's go to English to Arabic. The cook is cowardly. So you have to, you have to add anything to the cook. You just write, pick up the word the, because no word for that. And cook is what? Bawarchi. Hmm? So write Bawarchi. Bawarchi. And then you add the, what do you add next? Uh, yeah, yeah, so you add the word buz. Buzdil. Buzdil. And what do you add at the end? Hey. Okay, this is a bit of a side note. The word uh, dil, what's dil mean? Heart. And buz in Persian means um, like a goat or a sheep. So buzdil is about a sheep heart, meaning they're normally a bit tender, soft, they're not brave, in it? The lion attacks them. So buzdil is a Persian, it's a merger of two words. So, so he's a buzdil, he's got a. So the cook is a sheep heart, yeah? meaning he's not, he's brave, not brave. The farmer is poor. Poor means faqir. Yeah. So you add farm and farmer is what kisan. So kisan. So you write here kisan. Kisan. Faqir. He. Yeah. The butcher is rich. What is the butcher? Qasai. So right. How do you do it? There's no word for the. You say qa. Qasai. Ghani is Arabic, you would say. You use the word Amir. Amir. Amir in Arabic also means leader. Leader is normally rich people. So it's a merge of verb. In Urdu, in Urdu also means Amir for leader as well. But Amir also means rich. So it depends on the context. So the word Amir can mean rich. And it can also mean leader, depending on the context. So Qasai, Amir. Qasai is rich. And the judge is trustworthy. Qali. Amanat. Amanat. So Amin is what? Because the students here know Arabic, but so that's why I'm using a lot of Arabic terms. So, so Amad Amin is a trust. And Dar, when you have the word Dar, you add that onto anything, and it, 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 it looks like Zu, yeah. It kind of has a meaning of possesses that. So Amanat, Amanat, Dar, Am, Amanat, Dar, meaning Zu Amanatin. He has amana. So qadi amana dar he. The judge is trustworthy. You it? Yeah? Again, there's lots of exercises which these will do them off camera in the later. Number four. So we don't we know how to make this a positive sentence. Okay? If you want to make a negative, what do you do? To make a sentence negative? Instead of he, you can add nahi before the word he. So for example, we had barhai amana dar he. So this is like the is a not basically, is not. So is not. So Barhai, Barhai is a carpenter. Barhai amanat dar he. Negative is what? Amanat dar nahi he. Tajir kamzor nahi he. Kamzor means, what does kam mean less? Zor means power. So kamzor, less power meaning B. So Tajir, because uh, Urdu, is, uh, Urdu is like a, like we call it a uh, military, like what it's called? Like, uh, look at the, so the history of Urdu, it's like merge of all language, a lot of languages. You get Persian words, you get Sanskrit words, you get Arabic words, and all come together really. 
So you get like come in Ur- Ar- Persian means come. So ta- Tajir is from Arabic. Arabic. Tijarat Dakshawna Kasadaha. Yes. Halunabi Okumala. Tijarat Nunjikum in Adabin. And so Tajir is Ismail Fa'il is a active participant. So Tajir comes or Nahihe. So the summary of the rule is Nahi. Nahi means what? Not. So Tajir comes or Nahihe. Got it? Let's try a few of them. So Kasai Amana Dar Nahihe. I translate that. The butcher is not trustworthy. Next one. Mochi. Gharib nahi hai. Qabla is not poor. Qabla is not poor. Gharib, again, you remember, but if you're doing Arabic, Gharib means what? Stranger. Stranger, traveler, wayfarer. Khazan chi. Treasure. Khazana? What's Khazana meaning even in Arabic? Treasure. Treasure, treasury. So Khazan chi. Chi is the emoji. So Khazan chi. The chi at the end means, again, the one who is in charge of the khazana. So khazanchi is a treasurer, treasurer, secretary, whatever. Ji kanjus, stingy. So kanjus nahi hai. So khazanchi, kanjus nahi hai. Ji. Next one. Qadi but surat nahi hai. Qazi is judge. And surat means picture form. And bad means bad bad. It's a bad picture. The, 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 the judge is not bad pictured, meaning he's not ugly. So bad, remember, these little tips will help you remember the words. So bad. So bad, for example, uh, bad amal, bad amal, bad amal means who does bad amal, bad actions, bad deeds, bad surat, bad naam, what's the name? So bad naam, bad name is bad name is what? He's infamous, uh, bad deal, his heart is put off. So the word bad, uh, sohbat means company, sohbat bad means bad company. So qazi bad surat nahi hai, the, the judge is not ugly. Ji. Dandan, saaz. Saaz again, saaz means to do something. So dandan is teeth. So, so the dentist. So dandan, saaz, kamzor, nahi, hai. What does that mean? No. The, the, because he has to pull your teeth out, he needs to pull your teeth out, so you have to be strong. So dandan, saaz, kamzor, nahi, hai. The, uh, what? Dentist. The dentist is not weak. That's the other way around. The dentist is not generous. How do you do this one? There's no need for the. So you see here? Dan dan saaz sakhi nahi hai. Yeah. The the washerman is not stingy. Dobi dobi kanjus nahi hai. The doctor is not strong. Doctor, you said doctor. You said doctor as well. You said tabib. The more the tabib. I'm not sure what's in the book. Tabib. Or you can say doctor. Tabib or doctor is what? You can say here. Taqtur. What is ta- taqa? Even in Arabic, taqa. The taqat. And the word, one of those endings that has the meaning. Taqat war zu. So, tabib, doctor, taqat war. Nahi he. Okay. The soldier is not weak, soldier is. See? Sipahi Kamzor Nahi He You have to add the eh uh, afterwards after. The he? Yeah. You can drop it off sometimes Sometimes it drops off That's the next one Sometimes it says Sipahi Kamzor Nahi Because Na He has a he sound in it I'm not Expert It has that he sound So sometimes you see it It's in Nahi You can just drop off the he as well But I think when you have he It's a bit more emphatic Like Nahi He As opposed to that one Again this is this is basically introductory Urdu. You have all the other book books later on, inshallah, more grammar. Okay? Rule number five, what you're just asking. Sometimes after the hay, before other nahi, you can move the hay. Okay? So for example, Mazdur mehnati he sus nahi. Because you already got joining word in the first part, isn't it? So you don't need another another joining word, you're kind of repeating a joining word. So if you got if you got joining word in the first part, you kind of remove the second part. So for example, Mazdur mehnati he, what does that mean? Hard working. Yeah, so the mazdoor, the work is hard working. Sus nahi. He's not lazy. Tajir kamzor hai. Taqat war nahi. The? Weak. Not strong. So because of one joining word, it's not need to join another one. You just leave it as it is. Yeah? Okay. Try it. Bismillah. Umar wakil hai. Mali nahi. Umar is a lawyer. Is a lawyer? Mali. It's not well. Because Mali is wealth in Arabic. Mali means gardener. Not gardener. He's a, he's a wakil, not a gardener. 
Do you read the next one, translate? Let's say lohar here. Uh, lohar? Lohar means uh, iron, metal. So lohar is one who deals with, is an iron smith. Blacksmith, ji. Barhai. Barhai means carpenter. Ji, so say lohar he barhai nahi. Zaid's uh, blacksmith, not a carpenter. Not a carpenter. Next one. Adil Tajir he dakya nahi. Adil Zaid is a The guy that drops off the mail, postman. So dak is post. Dak khana, post office. Dakya, postman. So Adil Tajir he dakya nahi. Okay, next one. Asalam. Mazdoor. Mazdoor is a worker, laborer. Hajjam. Barber, hair man, hair person, G, the hair one. Is it? Barber. Barber. So, Aslam Mazdoor hai Hajjam nahi. Okay, let's do this one. It's a bit more challenging. The dentist is not generous. Who did that one? So? Dandan Saz. Dandan Saz. Sakhi nahi. Sakhi nahi or it also Sakhi nahi hai. The washerman is not stingy. Conjuice. Conjuice nahi or conjuice nahi hai. The doctor is not strong. Doctor, um, uh, talk. Talk at war? Talk at war nahi hai. Nahi hai. We should add the other ones with better. Yeah. Okay. So, for a second, okay, we'll go through more practice with the knowledge. We'll go through all the rules first and we practice all of these later. Any questions? This vocabulary you need to learn and pronounce it. We'll go that inshallah off. Come up. Okay. Make a question. Heard a question. You add the word kya at the beginning and you change the tone. So, Ahmad taqat war hai. Kya Ahmad taqat war hai? I'll shake your head a bit. Yes? You got it? So, for example, so Umar darzi, what's Umar darzi hai mean? Umar is a tailor. Kya Umar darzi hai? Make something? Question. So, is Umar a tailor? Understood? Okay. And to answer the questions, we can say ji ha. What does ji ha mean? Yes, and nahi or ji nahi is no. so. so but, but you can also say ji on its own to means yes, and nahi means no. So the more formal way ji ha, ji nahi. And if you say ha on its own, it means yes, and nahi on its own means no. Or ji on its own means yes. Yes, you got it? Okay, ji. So for example, the previous question is what? Kya Umar Marzdur hai? Ya kya Umar Darzi hai? Say ji ha, Umar Darzi hai. Or ji nahi, umar drazi nahi hai. Yes? Okay, let's try a few of them. Okay, we've got a few more words here. So let's try. Bismillah. Mahir? What does Mahir mean? Expert. Expert. Mahara. Not in the Quran. Not Mahara, the Hadith. So, kya bawad chi Mahir hai? Cook. Cook, yeah. Ji. Yes, he's an expert. Ji. Next one is going to be what? Kya me'mar? Buzdil hai? Is the me'mar is a kabla? Kabla. No. Builder. Is a builder. A car. Hmm. Ji nahi. Buzdil nahi. Buzdil nahi. No, he's not. Ji. Next one. So, kya hijam kanjus? Hajjam. Hajjam. Fa'al. Like labban tammar. Ji. So, kya hajjam kanjus hai? Ji ha kanjus hai? Sakhi nahi. Translation? Is the baba stingy? No, he's not. Ji ha? Yeah. Yeah, he is stingy, but he's not generous. Not generous. Do next one. Yeah, kasai to nurse. Yeah, kasai to nurse. Is the kasai? Jad no. Kasai is butcher. Butcher. Is it butcher? Healthy. Healthy. Yes, the butcher. Again, this word. If you want to understand this word, again, it's extra stuff. Begin is explaining it. It might come in handy as you guys just the bayan the lectures. Durus was durus mean. Sahihun. Correct. And tan means body. So man means mind, soul, spirit. Man. And tan, body. So tan durust? Good body. Correct body. You get it? From Persian. Tan durust. So tan durust hai. Qasai tan durust hai. The butcher is? Is what? Tan durust. Healthy. Okay. The dentist is not generous. This came before. I think I didn't, I didn't, uh, wait now, okay. Now we've got a few little rules, bits and bobs in between. We'll explain it here. The word or is funny. Word or means 
And the word or in English means either. So or the Urdu or. Urdu or means what? And. Okay, you can join two words together, two sentences together. For example, Umar mehnati or amanadar hai. Umar is hardworking and trustworthy. Ahmad kamzor or bimar hai. Ahmad is weak and ill. So the word or joins two sentences together, two words together. B, what does B mean? Also, along with Ayudan. Because you know Arabic, also. So for example, Kya Yunus mehnati hai? So, ji ha, mehnati he or amanat dar bi. He is hardworking and is also honest. So, the bi means also. So, or and and bi means also. And then we have a C. I came before. So, this is a mistake. The word is supposed to change here and it changes. Lekin means but. So, Yunus mehnati he. Lakin, like lakin in Arabic, lakin, lakin, but however, amanat dar nahi, he is not, what? Well, not trustworthy. So you have or, what does or mean? And B, also, and lakin, however, or but, depending on the context. Okay? Let's try this one now, a bit longer. Okay? Again, we're going through all the rules together. Normally, we have to go through bit by bit over a few days. I'm just trying to get the videos all in one. So we have the, all the rules, we go over the practice channel later on. So, kya lohar bahadur hai? Bahadur means brave. So, kya lohar bahadur hai? What does that mean? It's blacksmith. Is the blacksmith? Brave. brave. Ji nahi? No. Bahadur nahi? No. He's not brave. Buzdil hai? He's a coward. coward. Lekin nek hai? Pais pais. Kya qasai tandurust hai? Kobla. Butcher. Oh, it's a butcher. Tandurust? Healthy. Healthy. Ji haan. Qasai tandurust hai? Yes. The butcher is healthy. Uh, Ataqat word B. He's also very strong. <coughs> Kya mi'mar buzdil hai? Is that? Kobla. Um, Billa. Billa. Uh. Is it Billa um, buzdil? A uh, coward. He's coward. He can't be coward. How do you hand the roof? Yes. Buz ji nahi. He is? No. He's not. Buzdil nahi. He is? No. See, there's no need for he here because why? The he is already understood from here. You get it? Lekin kamzor hai. He is? Weak. Or bimar. B. Or bimar he. Because you already got the word he here. You don't need it again there. Are you following? So he's also ill. So you say bimar b hai. If you wanted to, but if you want like more emphasis. Because again, it comes here, isn't it? It comes in the first sentence. Already in the first sentence. So you don't to repeat it again. Okay, next one. Kya tajir mehnati hai? Is the businessman hard working? Ji nahi? No. Mehnati nahi hai? He's not hard working. Sust hai? Lekin neg hai? You got it? Last one. Kya mazdoor bad surat hai? What's mazdoor? Worker. Ajir, the worker. Is a worker ugly? Ji nahi bad surat nahi? Khub surat hai. Khub means like khub. Bar khub, mashallah. Very good. Very beautiful. It's beautiful. It's khub beautiful. Durus. Tan durus. Tan? Tan durus. B. Or it's also healthy. Got it? Let's try this one now. Is Aslam a postman? Ji. Abdurrahman, let's try. Kya Aslam? Kya? Da kya? Da kya? Da kya aslam? Da kya? Kya aslam da kya hai? Ji nahi aslam. Ji nahi good. Ji nahi. Aslam qadi hai. Aslam qadi hai good. Aslam qadi hai. Da kya? Da kya nahi hai. Or you can also say da kya? Nahi. Nahi. Good. Next one. Who's turn? Who's turn? Kya Ma'mar Ma'mar is Billa Mazdoor is worker Mazdoor Kya Mazdoor Amanat Dar Amanat Dar Again Kya Kya Mazdoor Amanat Dar Ji Ha Mazdoor Amanat Dar Ji Kya Zaid Hajjam Ji Kya Zaid Hajjam Ji Ha Zaid Hajjam Tajir Tajir Next one 
माली माली क्या माली कंजूस है जी 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 हाँ माली कंजूस है